For those who don't know, I have been playing Fortnite since the start, even since Season 0. I got introduced to it in around September, October time. Um, I was playing with someone and um, they said, hey, you should play this game. It's called Fortnite. I went onto the Microsoft Store and I typed it in. There was a trailer that came up and I vividly remember me saying, is it the game with the trailer where the bus honks its horn? What did you expect? So obviously I've been here since season zero all the way to chapter two, season five. So I thought it would be fitting to rank every single Fortnite season from the start to see where Fortnite declined, then rised again, then declined again and probably rise back up soon. I'm going to be ranking every Fortnite season in history. Let's begin. <laughs> Sorry, it's season 16 actually, I think. Anyways. This is tier list with all the Fortnite seasons, and I believe they're in order, so... That's gonna help us differentiate them from the crowd. So let's start with season one. Season zero wasn't really a thing because it wasn't the season, so shut up. Okay, season one, it has got to be good. Amazing, actually. Um, it was, if we didn't have Fortnite season one, we would not have Fortnite anyways. It, it's what kick-started Fortnite becoming a popular game. And... No, times were very simpler back then. You, no one knew how to build. You felt like a god if you even killed someone. Building was basically just like walls and nothing else, just to protect yourself for a few more seconds before your eventual death. It, it felt like everyone was bad at the game. And every time you played, you'll be progressing in the leaderboards. You will be prog progressing and getting better each time. And... There was no such thing as playground mode or anything. It was just simple. Hop into a game, die, hop into a game, win, freak out, scream at the top of your lungs because you won a game of Fortnite. It was the hip new thing and everyone liked it. So that is why it is in Amazing. Season 2, it has got to be amazing again. Um, Not God tier, but it is really on the borderline. If there was like another one, another list above amazing, I would, I would pick that one. Um, it was because, well, the battle pass, you know, you felt like a god once again if you got the Black Knight. Like, it was like the age of customization in Fortnite. Like, season one, yeah, I had an item shop, but here, it, like, skins became more accessible, and, you know, it. You felt like you stood from the crowd when you... You would never have a better feeling than, like, being in a lobby, you being a Black Knight and everyone else being, like, lower skins. You felt like you were the best player in that whole lobby because no one you really knew how to get better to level up that quick. So if you did, it... It... It just felt amazing and I loved the game to death. Um, chapter... Why do I keep on saying chap? Season 3, God tier. It was when, in my opinion, Fortnite reached its peak. Um, it was like its first collaboration, which was got John Wick. The Raven, actually. I think it was the Raven. I don't I don't I don't remember the skin, but it was like, hey, this skin that everyone likes is in the game. Oh my god. And it wasn't as good as the Black Knight. It wasn't really as good, but it's a lot more memorable. It's a lot more like pro it's it's minimalistic and that's what i like um but away from the battle pass um some of the best locations ever just kept on growing in popularity everyone went to tilted yeah it was in chapter two what it was in season two but you know nearer to the end i believe i don't know i don't remember because it was like 2017 so but chat mm, Season 3 has got to be my favourite skin. What? I cannot speak today. My favourite season of all time. It has got to be. 
Season 4, haha, I didn't say chapter. Season 4 has got to be amazing again. Basically, all the old seasons, those were the best because it, it just was. Fortnite was Fortnite. Nothing could stand in its way. YouTube videos were just, like, just everywhere. Fortnite, Fortnite. Fortnite season revealed. Fortnite battle pass leaked. Fortnite Battle Pass revealed. Let's go through them. Everyone did nothing but Fortnite for a while, and this was when it was like at its peak. Season 1, people started. Season 2, a lot more. Season 3, oh, this is a big game. Season 4, just carrying on going up, you know? But it was the age where, like, Dusty Depot wasn't a thing anymore. It's like really sad. And it was the first sign of just Epic Games doing stuff to the map, which really, really shouldn't. It seemed cool at the time, but when we look behind at the old seasons, it did become a mistake, despite the fact it was cool. And if they didn't, they would seem like idiots. But believe me, it will be better without that giant crater in the middle of the map. Season 5... It's got to be good. Um, not really as good. I started to lose interest. Um, it was still popular. But the skins. Just look at the skins. They're horrible. Like season 4 introduced. Leveling up your skins to make it look more. Amazing. Season 5 kind of did it. They did it. But they didn't do it as good. Um, Ragnarok. One of my favourite skins. Especially when leveled up, but not really as good. Um, Lazy Links, I believe, was in the game. Um, I hate that. I hated that. Everyone did. Um, it started to become like everyone had a disease called Fortnite fatigue, where you just didn't play the game because it wasn't as fun. Epic Games did stuff that they really should not have done, and just made it like, oh, I wish we had the old Fortnite back. You are lucky to have that kind of Fortnite. Look what we got now. Chapter 6. Meh. It's just a big old meh. The skins, I hated. It's got to be my least favourite skin. Like, Battle Pass. Ever. Ever. Like, the new recent se seasons. Yeah, it's not as good, but it's better than that, I've got to say. Um, yeah, I really don't like it. Um... They, um, it was all Halloween themed, I believe, looking at the picture. They had husks in the game. Um, I hated husks, everyone did, but Epic Games refused to remove them. Why? You were killing off your game eventually. Like, just an eventual downfall of Fortnite starting now. And it was just like, hey, just stop it. Stop whatever you're doing and just, oh, well, I want season four back. Season seven. Meh, once again, um, all the seasons starting now, just down, 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 down. And it just felt like Fortnite could do no wrong, but they did this. How could they mess up a gaming, a game that everyone loved? Now everyone hates it. Like, what did you do? Why did you do? Explain yourselves. It's just like that whole sword, the Infinity Blade. Oh, that did not go down well. I don't know how many drugs the Epic Games team took to think that that was a good decision to do. This was not good. It was not good. A big yikes, if I may say so myself. Season 8. Wait, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. Yeah, Season 8. Mm, bad. It was when I started to stop. I barely played the season, season eight. Um, they had like all this adventurous theme, that weird castle, like in the top left of the map. Like, no, I don't like that. And the battle pass was not any better. Yeah, Peely was a thing. That was like the only amateur skin I, I saw in that battle pass and the map. Oh, it started to be where they started to kill off Tilted, which was dumb, but just they kept on adding guns, features that no one liked, and it became just, just stop, either 
stop producing the game or just carry on making it good because I don't want it to die an eventual death, which it had for a minute. Season 9, absolute car crash. Um, bad, actually. Um, I like Neo Tilted and Mega Mall. That was, th that has got to be legitimately the only memory I've got of season 9. Neo Tilted and Mega Mall. It might not even be in this season, but that was the only memory I had. Surprisingly. And I, don't, I just didn't like it. Like, yeah, I didn't. Now season 10, you know where I'm gonna put this. This is the most trash season I've ever seen in the game. Season 10 killed Fortnite for like a few months. I cannot explain to myself the amount of hatred I had for Epic Games when they released Season 10. The absolute car crash it was. You don't know how many emails I wrote to them saying how much I hated them. I just... No. No. Mechs. Disgrace. Dusty. Oh, look, guys, it's back. There were mechs in the game. We don't care. I just... I just didn't like it. I just didn't like it. I stopped playing Fortnite rather than then. I just stopped. I deleted the game. I'm not even joking. And that was like the age of me getting my PC. So I did play it for a while because, well, I wanted to test out my PC. That was the whole reason me buying a PC was to play Fortnite and gaming and Fortnite and YouTube. And hmm. <laughs> but I just, I just didn't like it. I, just, I, I, I had hatred for the game. I had so much hatred for the game right then and there. Well, that was it. Just season ten just flew past because I didn't play it. I I don't remember playing any other games. Um, I played Fortnite, obviously, but nothing really in between. Chapter 2, Season 1. Good, actually. Um, better than Season 10. Um, I think Chapter 2 was like a bit of fresh air. We had all fatigue from the map. We had fatigue from Season 10. We wanted a change. And a whole black hole publicity stunt yeah freaked us all out and freaked all the kids out oh where's Fortnite gone but apart from that like chapter 2 was really good we changed the graphics which I didn't really like um, I like the old graphics and I really wish they'd come back make it come back but now the new graphics have like a lot more possibility with like just graphical upgrades Fortnite on PS5 looks amazing and you know I don't think they'll be able to reach that kind of fidelity and stuff like that on the old graphics engine and hopefully Fortnite will upgrade to Unreal Engine 5 seeing as that is their own team making Unreal Engine make it happen chapter 2 season 2 amazing I'm not even joking that is god that is god tier they did um those special people where you had to kill. They had a lot of damage, you had to put them in good. Like Brutus. Brutus. Um Tientina, I think. Um Like all those key cards. Just I loved them. I kept going to the grotto. That was like the only place I went and for a while. And I loved it. I, I loved the game. I really did. I felt like it was back to where it was in season six. It was on par with season five and four. But then we just had to go into season three. It's good. It was good. Um, I still like the game, but in retrospect, it wasn't as good as season five. What? It was. It wasn't as good as chapter two, season two. Um, the whole map was flooded. Whose bright idea was that? But apart from that, they, it was a pretty good map for once, and I like. I liked it. Um, I wish. Um, I wish. They would just become better seasons, and I don't know anymore. I'll just I do I don't really like that season as much, but not as much as that season four, five, season four, yeah, season four. That's a big old meh. Like I don't I don't I, don't, I didn't really like that season. Um, it was fine, but like it just felt like it dragged on the event. It dragged on. 
just like, oh, we saw someone's head in the ocean. Event? And like, the event was cool, but it was only for like, die-hard franchise people who were like, this is so cool, oh my god. It wasn't really cool for the people who don't watch that kind of stuff. Like, it was, it, it's a bit like, basically, that season was for adults who love the movies or children. I like, like, children oh! to the event and like, this is so cool, my favorite character in my Marvel films is here. I don't, I don't even know if it's Marvel Avengers, I don't know, I'll shut up. But, <laughs> or adults where I was like, hey, I like this, I put time off work for this event. But that's only, like, not in the middle, not like 15, 16, 17, 18, or not even 19, just that kind of area, they, they didn't really target um, as much. But, yeah. Season 5, I believe, season 5. Um, it was bad. It wasn't unplayable, I still played it, but the season itself wasn't good. I really didn't like it. Um, they put in a Mandalorian, Man Mandalorian in, and that was cool. For Disney Plus owners, I am not one of that. I am not one of those, but, you know, it's like, oh, Baby Yoda. Who cares? My love for Baby Yoda got killed off on Saturday Night Live. Hey! Oh, yeah! But I just didn't like the season, I've got to say. There's honestly, that the whole zero point freaked out so many diehard fans. Like, the zero point? What's going to happen to the zero point? I, I, I don't know. Why are you b building up like conspiracy theories about a ball which is going to blow up? Who cares? It, it, you have GCSEs to revise for. But I just didn't like the season, so um, yeah, uh, it's gonna go in bad. I still played it, just the season wasn't good. Season six. It was a big old mess. I, uh, it's the season where I got banned. Um, I don't think it was. It's was actually season. 14, 15, 16, 17. But this season, like, it was hyped up. Like, what's gonna happen to the zero point? Where's Jonesy? And it just, like, no. I, I don't care. The map, they basically spilled soup on the map and called it a day. There, were, there used to be all these big map changes which we were all hyped for. And so many clickbait YouTubers said, Volcano erupted in Fortnite? And I like that because it was like a sense of unity with the player and with the developer. Like, oh, you're going to be so hyped for this, guys. I cannot believe the excitement. <coughs> <coughs> yeah, you're, it's all going to get all hyped up. You're going to love it, too. I don't know. Jonesy answers the call. He has a voice. Yay! That was it. That was it. That 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 was the season for me. Um, I don't like the seasons anymore. They don't really def differentiate them apart. It's just seasons aren't really a big thing anymore. Barely any map changes. New battle pass, but I didn't even bother buying it for the past two seasons. And just um. Seasons are only meant nowadays for building up the storyline and the lure of Fortnite, which I, I'm not interested in, so what's the point of getting hyped up about a season, which you're not going to buy the battle pass in, you're not going to like the map, obviously, because they can't, they they mess it up, mess it up every time, and the storyline, which you just don't care about. There is honestly nothing to like in, there is honestly nothing to like in the new seasons, but that was the tier list of all the Fortnite seasons. Let me save and download it. Never mind, I'm not going to save or download it. And thank you everyone for watching. Um, more tier list stuff coming out. More tier list stuff coming out soon. I don't know though. No. No. Okay.
But <laughs> thank you everyone for watching. And I'll see you later. Goodbye.